guys, welcome back to the Pokemon Penumbra Moon Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we took on Guzma as well as Gladian. Uh, I had the most confusing just battle with Gladian because Gladian made dumb mistakes, but it is what it is. Anywho, in today's episode, we are going to be taking on the Kahuna Ulula Island Nanu. I didn't take him on the last episode because honestly, I was terrified. Um, and my brain was broken from the fact that Gladian made so many stupid mistakes. So I really thought that I did not want to play uh, games with the devil. Uh, in hindsight, I don't know what I'm worried about because I have two fighting types and a fairy type. And honestly, I think this is going to be a walk through the park. So, we are just going to murder Nanu, hopefully relatively fast, because either this episode is going to be me just taking on Nanu, or this episode is going to be us taking on Nanu and it's taking it like 10 minutes at best, and then the next 10 to 20 uh, are going to be Aether Paradise. That could be scary. He started off with a Sableye. This thing's gonna Mega Evolve on me, isn't it? There it is. I'm just like so used to this game giving Megas to like to trainers, while I can't even use Megas until post game. That like every Mega Pokemon, every Pokemon that can Mega, I just assume will Mega. At least one. So, that's Sableye. It's fucking Sableye. What a dumb dumb. This poor guy. He's gonna get. I'm gonna. Full heal, just out of fear of hitting myself, even though it's only 30%. I'm gonna recover. Interesting. I'm just gonna murder you then. I outspeed you too, you fucking dummy. Or Sableye, dude. Sableye gets Prankster as its regular ability, and then its um, mega ability is like Magic Bounce or something like that. So, like, he really just does not. He doesn't get, you know, that good of an advantage. I'll tell you that. I'm just gonna Drain Punch this Crocodile. I made a mistake. Oh, never mind. I made a fucking grand gesture of a, of a decision. I'm just gonna keep switching between Ulysses and fucking Mac, dude. I'm gonna be honest with you and just see what happens. Okay. I'm glad I switched. Moonblast? You have fucking flash cannon, you fool. And you have a berry to heal that. This still kills you. Hydragon is not a bulky Pokemon. So, I'm not surprised that that just happened. Plus, it's still quite effective. Mag is burned, so I think I should actually, now that I think about it, I should probably take advantage of that. Sharpedo. I'm just gonna... We're just gonna... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. And it's dead. And that meant absolutely nothing. He didn't even have rough skin. He had, like, Moxie. Does this get Moxie? I think he gets Moxie. That's terrifying. A Bisharp. Hey. This is also terrifying. Also sword of dancing. And I might be up Shit's Creek, I'll tell you what. Never mind. He just gave me the free kill on a Bisharp, dude. That was a plus two okay. That was a plus two Bisharp right there. I don't resist Iron Head. Iron Head very well could have killed Mac. Mac's actually pretty bulky, so it might not have. Um, but wow. Three minutes, huh? That's all it took. I sped up, granted. But, um, yeah, that's all it took. Three whole minutes. Three whole minutes to destroy this Kahuna. I spent 25 minutes fucking fighting a Cradilly against Olivia. 25 minutes just on the Cradilly. That was the worst experience of my life, by the way. And I just fucking come in and destroy Nanu with no problem at all. I thought you'd be harder. These actually, these trials have been actually a lot easier. Um than the last ones. Like, uh, Akala Island really fucked my shit up, I'll tell you that. A fucking Araquanid. Um, Marowak killed two of my Pokemon, so it really didn't take that much effort for him. But, like, <clears throat> fucking Sophocles, I just had to wait that thing out. I just, like, that thing physically, there was no way that thing was ever going to sweep me. Or, like, even one-shot any of my Pokemon. I just stalled it out. So it struggle killed itself. That's really kind of depressing. Uh, and what was the last one? What was the last, um, trial? I can't remember. I just forgot. Oh, um, Mimikyu. Mimikyu actually could have been worse. Mimikyu actually could have been a lot worse because that thing could have, um, that thing could have definitely swept my team. It had Sword Zance. I only, I literally, okay. Well, I should have probably avoided that. I literally could have lost... I probably would have lost that 
if I hadn't hit that those two will o back to back. I genuinely would have probably lost that battle. So, doesn't really matter. Um, anywho, Mr. Raptor is going to die. Mr. Raptor is going to get demolished. Discharge probably would have killed either way, and that special defense drop was just a fucking cherry on top, to what. Okay. Um. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe Mac? Probably Mac? Yeah, Mac. Mac can just sweep everything. Nothing hurts Mac anymore. He's a god. She's a god among men. Yeah, fake out. Great. Never mind. Okay. Well, that's actually a little scary. Bang punch. Pursuit. Oh, you're dead. All right. Bye, Bye Ambipom. It was nice having you. I love Ambipom, by the way. Like, I... I don't... I know I probably say it a lot. All the evolutions introduced in Gen 4 were fantastic. I love every single one of them. Ambipom is so adorable. I love everything about her. Him. It. Them. I don't know. Can I kill you without dying? Oh, yeah. Okay. That's not even gonna do anything to me. Oh, wait, you live! <clears throat> Jesus, on a stick. Good lord. Could you maybe not do that? Is Beat Cannon normal? Fire? I'm assuming it's fire. Beat Blast, that's what it's called. That's a normal type move. Hello. Why is this fucking me up? Hello? Is there a reason? I don't know. Let's see if you can handle this. Raph, you can handle this. It's fine. Raph, you barely handled that, but you know what? I appreciate you. And everything you do for us. Hey, you have roost. Okay. I'm actually surprised that you survived that drain punch, to be honest with you. I kind of was expecting death. So, uh, imagine my surprise when you were still standing. So, maybe you could just not do that anymore. I'm just flamethrower you. Can you, can you maybe, like, not, perhaps? That'd be awesome. Oh, look, a burn. Look at that. Oh, the cookie crumbles. Are you going to go away now? Oh, yeah, you are. Okay. See you later. It's been nice knowing you, Toucanon. I'm really glad that you just spent, like, two minutes, uh, honestly, being more of a challenge than Nani was. So, oh. No. Hmm. I don't know what to do here. I really don't. What moves do you have, my friend? I do not appreciate them. I already don't like them. I'm going to turbo. This thing's calm minding. Uh, there it is. Calm minding. That's exactly. I meant to say wish. I don't know why I said calm mind. I really don't. But um, amnesia. Calm minding. Uh, calm mind is actually significantly scarier. So, just gonna bite this in the ass real quick. I'm already on your level. Dazzling gleam does nothing to me. Suck a dick. I don't know. I'm gonna need you to go away now. Yeah, I need you to go away. Please, for the love of God. Let's see if I can get an age of power boost. Did that happen? Probably. Maybe not. Probably not. Age of power does nothing. We're gonna be at this a while. He's got Wish. I forgot about that. I actually genuinely sat there and forgot about Wish. I got. Oh, look at that! Age of power boost. That's all I needed. Okay, let's just keep going. Just keep playing this game, buddy. Give me another age of power boost. No? Okay. Well, I tried my best. Okay. Uh, let's max potion up. I'm really mad that there's, like, a Mega Auto No on my screen to begin with, because this thing is literally not meant to hurt me and meant to stall me out like a bitch. I'm gonna Shell Smash. There's nothing. And I think I already outspeed you with this. Just this alone. Auto No is not a fast Pokemon, right? He is not. That answers my question. I definitely think any other Pokemon he had on his team could have fucked me up, but... Get that plus six. Easy mode. Calm minding. That's cute. Really cute. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna Inferno Overdrive. It probably won't kill you, but it'll hurt. And the best you can do is wish. Because Dazzling Gleam ain't doing shit to me, honey. Tell you what. Oh, look, you lived. Okay. Well, fantastic, isn't it? Okay. Well, luckily for me, Flamethrower should kill. There we go. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Hold your applause. All right. Well, there goes my stupid Roto. I'm not going to use it. I, I used that, like, completely on accident. I wasn't even paying attention. I meant to... Nope. I meant to use a Restoration Wing. That's what I meant to do when I activated the thing, too. Isn't that crazy? But it helped me out. Got the team up some levels, so I'll take what I can get. All right. I don't really like being here. I really don't. I don't. I don't. I don't at all. Um, 
Let's start off with Dexter again and hope for the best. Let's just fight him. I can't avoid these trainers. I will die. I will die. I'll get murdered. It's the last thing I need, to be honest with you. A Kecleon. Aw, that's cute. Hi, Kecleon. Can you hurt me? I don't think you can hurt me. Maybe? Probably? Maybe? Possibly? I don't know. Can I substitute without dying? Let's find out. I don't know why you would do that, my friend. I'm gonna fucking commit a murder. I swear to god. Okay. Um, special defenses. Oh, probably Wrath. Maybe Wrath. Turbo. One of the two. Uh. Uh. Which is special defense? 149. 146. 162. Probably going to Wrath. Wrath's probably my best bet here. Thunderbolt. I swallow that. You fool. I'm gonna go for a flamethrower. Stealth Rock. That did absolutely nothing to help me. Okay. Well. Oh. Well, that actually, that solved itself. Mm, and it doesn't burn you out anymore. Why, do, why don't, like, if you use a fire type move, first off, okay, first off, fire type should not be getting frozen. That's ridiculous and stupid. Second off, if you use a fire type move, doesn't that usually thaw you out? Did they get rid of that in Gen 7? Or is that something, is that like a false memory in my head? But because I'm pretty sure usually if you use something like flame wheel or flamethrower or fire punch and stuff like that, it would thaw you out immediately. So I don't know what's going on. This game sucks. Flamethrower should kill you, right? Okay, guess not. I can be wrong. So you've used Stealth Rock, Ice Beam, and Thunderbolt. I don't know what your last move is. But clearly it's not something you intend to use, so there you go. Alright. Um I don't really I don't know. I'm gonna go in turbo. Please don't be a water type. I don't like that. I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna heal because I don't think I like where this is about to go. And there it is. Turbo, you can lift that. Turbo barely lived that, and he resisted it. So, I can only imagine what it would have done to literally anybody else on my team. What the fuck is going on? Hello? God, are you there? Jesus Christ. Oh, and a Mega Pidgeot. Okay, well, I made a mistake switching into you. Uh oh. Uh. Uh, I don't have many choices. Oh my god, pre marina Ulysses, please. For the love of God. It's a mega. Anyway. Please don't hurt me. Oh my god. Oh my god. Well, I'm dead. I'm dead. This is how I end. This is how I die. It's been nice knowing you, everyone. Oh, Christ on a stick. I need to switch into Turbo. This thing just fucking hyper beamed me. What the fuck? I don't like this game. I don't like this game anymore. I don't want to play this game anymore. Hyper beam is the last thing you need to be using on me, sir. And or ma'am. I think you're a ma'am. Okay, we need to go. We need to go away. I'm, I'm tired of this episode already. We're only 13 minutes into it. This is not ideal in any way, shape, or form. Now, the good news is all it can do is hyper beam me. And it's going to continue to do so because it's a bitch. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to amnesia up and avoid the inevitability of death. I'm just going to go for an Inferno Overdrive and see how it goes. Good lord. Okay. Let's see how much this does. Because that's my ideal situation. I think I'm just going to take on the trainers on this first floor and then call it an episode depending on how it goes. Okay. Well, this thing's going to recharge, so I'm going to do that. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Wow. That definitely could have gone better, but it also could have gone worse. So, you know what? We're going to be fine. We're all going to survive. Now that I've said that, everybody's going to die at some point. So, you, 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 you. There we go. That should be fine, right? Maybe, possibly, I don't know. But, uh, oh. I don't want to fight anybody else, please. 
but I have to. What else am I supposed to do in this episode? These Pokemon trainers are terrifying. They all have Mega Evolutions, by the way. Uh, the first two have already Mega Evolved, so I can only assume the rest of them are going to as well. The Skarmory? Really? Like, can you not, maybe? Perhaps? That'd be cool. Of course you have Sturdy. And you have self -heart. Why? Like, what? what's with all the Pokemon that have Sturdy that then proceed to set up hazards on me? I don't have a Pokemon with Rapid Spin. Like, could we not? Perhaps? Oh, a Blissey Gray. Awesome. I can't hate you. But you can't hate me. Funny how that works. Uh, Mac, I'm gonna just let you take care of this thing. That did, like, a lot more than I was anticipating. What a Bulbub. I'm just gonna set up on this thing and just fucking kill the rest of our team. That's really kind of what I'm gonna do. I might as well. That's what I'm gonna do. Because Blissey physically cannot hurt me. Uh, though his Ice Beams are doing a lot more damage than I would anticipate from a Blissey of all things, so... <sighs> this episode already has me on heightened alert. I'm on high alert. My anxiety's heightened. I'm not ready for this. This is the last thing I need. So... Let's just... Let's just plus six myself, and then hope for the best. I think its special attack might be a little higher than its physical, so that might be what's happening right now, but... Either way, like, you'd be better off just fucking seismic tossing. Actually, probably not at your level. Yeah, at level 81, not exactly. Um, I'm only at plus three. Well, fuck. Okay, that's just one more. Plus four it. Uh, I'm, I'm healing right now because I'm worried for crits. Because a crit plus burn will kill me. I don't feel like it. So, this thing's probably going to run out of ice beams before I even plus six. Which is really great. Okay, that's plus five. I just need one more, and I, I if I do it if I don't if I do that right now, this motherfucker has toxic. Look at you, you dummy. Is that plus six or is that plus four? I, I genuinely have already lost count again. It's plus six. Fantastic. Okay, let's see. I'm just gonna we're just gonna do that. All that HP guzzled up straight into my health bar. Now, do not have anything that can... Alright, well, bye, Drompa. It's nice knowing you. I love Drompa as a Pokemon, by the way. It looks so great, and I love him. And I'm really sad that I've actually never used one before in my life. And a Bastiodon. This thing has Sturdy. This thing's gonna Metal Burst me, and I'm gonna die. Yep. Exactly what I anticipated. There was re I mean, I should have switched out. I should have switched out. I probably would have been smarter. I deserve that. I earned that. That's exactly what I needed. Uh, in that case... I hate this game so much. I'm gonna sneak over there and get toxic. Okay. Well, that's fine. It's okay. It's fine. Uh, that red card really kind of, I knew, like, they were just gonna randomly pick a Pokemon for me to not lose, so... Great. And it was one of my walls. Fantastic. I'm gonna bring my other wall. I'm gonna bring you. Bringing you might be fun, but I'm not going to do it. Okay. Bringing you your light. We're going to try not to die. I'm going to scream. Okay, we're going to go get toxic. We're going to sneak over and get toxic, and then we're going to call it an episode. That's what we're going to do, boys. We're going to hope for the best. That's Hi, Gladian. Welcome back. Okay. I'm going to try not to die. I'm gonna hope and pray that life will uh, help me pass this hellhole of a bullshit live. <clears throat> I just don't really. I don't have any words. I'm gonna avoid trainers. Oops. 
main to get over here. I think it's over here. It's down here. It's down here in this corner. Is it this corner? Oh no. Okay. We're gonna get it. We're gonna get toxic and we're gonna end the episode because I don't wanna die. Yeah. Ah! How did you see me all the way over there? You commit a murder. He's got four Pokemon Greg. Oh, and an Arcanine. Fantastic. This is exactly what I wanted to see right now. Oh, and an X attack. Great. So now he's going to be doing a shit ton of damage to me. And he outspeeds me, which is even better. Arcanine doesn't get Earthquake, right? Let's find out. Arcanine, do you learn any ground high moves or fighting depth? You learn close combat. So... You learn reversal. Gen 7 will you learn, my friend. Oh, he's extreme speed, fire fang, odor sleuth, roar, bite, thunder fang. He doesn't learn. He learns close combat through uh, breeding. Now, the question is does he have close combat in this game? Because looking at his moveset, he might have, I mean, he usually, he only learns Flare Blitz loot through, uh, through that too. So, he also learns Thunderfang and Wild Charge, right? Do you learn Wild Charge? You cannot learn, you don't, why do I feel like I've seen Wild Charging, oh, that's an Adriano hack, usually, isn't it? He, yeah, he only learns Thunderfang, isn't it? Um, hmm. This is going terribly already. Eviolite might be a good bet. I don't know. I don't know how this is gonna go. I'm gonna go into Turbo and see what happens. Sunny day. Well, you learned that. That's free. Good to know. I'm gonna Ancient Power and see what happens. Oh, you have Wild Charge. Great. Okay. Ancient Power should kill you. Does not. Great. Fantastic. Okay. Wow, this is going terribly. I really don't want this sun to be up. I really don't. I can't have the sun be up, if anything. Uh, because I will get fucked. Okay. Wow, this is like going terribly, really. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, it's going awfully. We're going absolutely terribly. What are you gonna bring out next? Probably a fucking fire type again. Is your special defense enough to survive a fire type attack in the sun? Probably not. And that's what scares me. And Dexter, I would bring you out, but I feel like he's gonna bring out something that has Solar Beam. I think my safest bet is probably Eviolite. And it's not by much. It really is not. Um. Sand, a Mag Mortar. I'm gonna heal. See what it does. Solar Beam. Yep, okay. Well, that's not good. How much does that do? Oh, not that much. I'm gonna. A high roll will kill me. A high roll will kill me. So, we're gonna play the waiting game on this sun. I can't lose another Pokemon. I cannot. Uh, and yeah, I think a high roll. I need to see what the high roll is and what the low roll is. So I just went down to 126, 124, so 110 seems to be what we're looking at. 132, sun's up, the sun's gone, he's gonna set up another sunny day. I'm gonna amnesia, and we're gonna be at this for a hot minute. I already know it. Okay. Wow, this episode's going great. I'm really mad that Raph's dead, because Raph actually probably would be solving all my problems right now. Uh, just through the fact that he resists probably just about every type of attack this Mac Mortar possibly has in its arsenal. I'm really glad that he's the one that, honestly, like, and this is going to sound really fucked up. Uh, out of all the Pokemon for that thing to red card me into just to Metal Burst, I would have rather it been Winnie than anybody else. 
So, and that sounds fucked, but uh, Winnie is probably the most, out of all the Pokemon on my team, expendable. And that sounds fucked up. But, I don't know. I just would rather, I'd rather have Raph. I'd rather have Raph. So, that's good. How many, you, this is like your second Pokemon too, so I just like realized that and kind of thought that through. That's great. Um, anyways, I'm like plus six, so I don't really think, and honestly, I don't know if you have any other, uh, I don't know if you have any other fire types on your team, but thank you for setting up that sun for me, because now I can just kill your last two Pokemon. Oh my god, a Leafeon. Isn't that cute? Just get rid of that. Look at that, Leaf Blade actually did a lot of damage. Let's just get rid of you. Go away. Go away. Get out of here. Fucking piece of shit. Okay. Bye, Leafeon. Um... The sun is still up. I'm gonna sand. Iliolas. How hard can you hit me, buddy? You have solar power and dry skin. One of those two. That does nothing. Yep, solar power. Okay, well, fire... Flamefair will kill you. Goodbye. It's been nice knowing you, Heliolus. I love Heliolus as a Pokemon. So, really, the fact that it's part normal, it makes it, like, really just annoying to use because of that, and just the additional fighting type weakness for no real reason, uh, really kind of sucks. But, there we go. Toxic. Look at that. Now we can put it, we can give it to Eevee Light, and I'm going to call it an episode before I die. So, let's get rid of Moonlight. So... Basically, the rest of Aether Foundation is, um, take on Faba. We take on Faba. Then we have to take on, I think, both Aether Paradise people and Team Skull. And then we get to Lusamine, and I think we have to fight Lusamine, um, this time around, too. So that's going to be fun. Let's see if we can survive. Then we will be doing all that in the next episode. So thank you all so much for watching. And if you guys enjoyed... Make sure you do smash that like button if you want to see more interesting stuff. Guy and get to pause it right into that PC party. Get with your friends. Follow me on Twitter at PCBillMaster. Join the Discord link is down below. If you guys enjoyed, it, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I'm PCBillMaster, and I'll see you guys next time.